Okay, so the packing begins, um, or the packing continues here, and Bailey, my dog, is going to help us out. Um, I use one of these nice big uh, storage bins, um, and they keep all my bedding. Um, this really works out well, because um, it kind of fits all pretty perfectly. So, over here we have my sleeping bag. I got a little bungee cord wrapped up in there, so it keeps it all nice and tight. Um, and here is my... Excuse me, Billy. In here is my air mattress. Um, it's got its own bag and the pump's included. So that squeezes right into there, like that. And then uh, a blanket um, for sleeping blanket. And then just throw that on there. So nice, tight. And, um, and then you just throw the top on. Always put your name on it. See my name on there. And, uh, and that way you can find it when when it's time to unload the bus and you need to get your stuff out. So, uh, and it's a good way to keep it stored and it's a good way to stack things. Say bye, Bailey. That's what I thought. So here we are. I've started uh, the many loads of wash that will end up being what I packed for the trip. Um, as you can see where my washer begins there. Um, what I normally do is I I start packing all my stuff on top of the dryer here so I know exactly uh, what I have and what's got to go. Um, I'll also put a list somewhere over here so I'll kind of check things off as I go. Uh, since this is a couple days beforehand and not the night before, um, I want to make sure I've not forgotten anything. Um, this over here is my bag. Uh, basically this is a large Reebok bag. Uh, I can fit just about all my clothes in it. Uh, it's nice and soft, so it stacks easily in the bus. And uh, it will eventually be quite heavy, so uh, that's one unfortunate part about it. It, uh, it does become quite large. Um, so that's where we are now in the process of packing. And Bailey's having a knife. All right, you can tell uh, here we are uh, just about to load in uh, the first bunch of stuff that I know I won't need for the next couple of days. Uh, that I can start packing. So um, here is uh, the first batch of, or at least that's a couple of batches of, of laundry that have been folded and ready to be uh, loaded into my large uh, duffel type bag. Um, the large bags are good because they're easy to easy to stack and easy to uh, you know put into the bottom of the bus when we get moving. Um, so I'm ready to get going here. As you can see, I got uh, some long sleeve shirts, some some sweatshirts, and some some sweatpants. Um, and if you go back here in the laundry room, you'll see I got more shirts and jeans and stuff ready to load it in next. Um, my trusted assistant, Bailey, is, is always here to help. So um, I'm going to start loading that in now, and then uh, I'll see what it looks like when I'm all done. And uh, I also have my, my, uh, my packing list here, little reminders for me what I need and what I need. What I, and everything I put in the bag, of course, I make sure that I've crossed off so I don't keep repacking the same stuff. So uh, that helps me kind of guide me along and make sure I've got everything I need. So I'll cross things off as I go. Well, since my trusted assistant Bailey is guarding the front door, um, we'll start on the next phase of our packing. Um, with most of my clothes now washed, folded, and uh, ready to go into the bag, uh, I'm going to start uh, getting in all my electronic stuff, which I do have quite a bit of. Um, everybody please make sure you take a charger for your cell phone. Um, I have, I bring two, one for the car and one for a regular standard outlet. Um, the car one comes quite, in hand, quite handy because the GPS system that I bring, and since I spend most of my day in a car, the GPS is very helpful. Um, but the car charger charges both my cell phone and the GPS. Um, have my iPod with a set of headphones for the bus, since that's my main uh, source of entertainment uh, for the four days we're on the bus and um, and that's my regular digital camera uh, with its charging station for uh, the battery I also bring a, a power strip that way I'm not hogging up uh, an outlet just to myself and uh, I mean if you have just the car charger I mean just the uh, cell phone charger um, and that's all you're gonna really plug in that's not a big deal I don't think you need to bring this but if you have like me three or four things that potentially could be plugged in uh, it's nice to bring a, a power strip these all will go in my backpack, um, and I keep them so uh, that way they don't get crushed in uh, in travels. 
Um, nothing worse than getting down there in New Orleans and finding half your stuff broken. So um, that's going to be it for now. See you soon.